Welcome back to another video. Before we get started, definitely check out two links in the description. One of them is a free Discord server, and there's also a Weeble sign up link below. Click on it, make a Weeble brokerage account, deposit $100, and get two free stocks. So, the markets lately are not doing so good. Today is September 17th. It's around like 8 a.m. when I'm making this video, and markets are extremely red. Pre market for the tech industry, negative 1.9% for the QQQ. And for the Dow, it's negative 1%. For SPY, it's negative 1.3%, possibly from the decline in banks and also tech. And then the small cap is negative 1.27%. No one is doing good at all. Yesterday, small cap did okay. QQQ did pretty terrible. Dow, pretty flat. SPY, sharp decline. But today, pre-market, another giant drop. Could this be what happened last year? month where everything just absolutely dropped so far the market has been pretty flat if you look at the technical analysis you clearly see every time when qqq drops to 270 ish it automatically does have a major rebound so maybe we'll see a major rebound if you look at the technical analysis part at open but i'm not really sure so far because yesterday the feds had some really really good news but that actually caused the markets to drop so when the Fed started talking, the markets actually went up. You can see around 1.30, 2 p.m. is when the Fed started wrapping up information. And around this time, the market spiked all the way up. QQQ and also other indices out there, QQQ went from like negative 1.63% all the way up to negative 0.69% in a very short amount of time. And then it absolutely just dumped. It's pretty painful. And so far, if you check out the news so far, you can see the stock market has now kind of peaked. The feds can only stimulate the market so much, and we already hit all-time highs for the tech industry. SPY, small cap, and Dow have somewhat returned to its original February value. And last but not least, if you check this out, you can see the stock futures are tumbling. Everyone's looking at the jobless reports. Okay, if you check this out, traders are looking at Thursday's economic data reports and the jobless claims. Now, on Wednesday, that's yesterday, the Feds actually said they will be having 0% interest rates for at least three years because the U.S. economy isn't doing so well. Also, the Feds upgraded their economic projections, which is good, saying how the overall economy isn't that much affected now as before. And they're also anticipating a shallower decline, which is also good. And also a lower unemployment rate by the end of the year, which is also fantastic. I've said many times before that this pandemic is somewhat temporary because when hotels, restaurants open up, they have to hire back those employees. So things are looking okay and life has kind of resumed back to normal, especially in my city. But of course, today the markets are extremely red. It's really not a fun time to be a bull right now, but hopefully we might see some kind of recovery. I'm honestly just banking to just be completely flat because I have cash secure puts. But so far, I mean, if you're holding calls today, is going to be a pretty scary day, especially market open. That's about it. Thanks for watching and comment below.